All right, guys, Junie B. Jones loves Aaron. Some Lauren. <laughs> Chapter five, hooray, princess clones. That night at dinner, a great idea came into my head. It came during my macaroni. Hey, I just thought of it. I shouted, I just thought of how to get that awesome guy to love me. I stuff the macaroni. We gotta get to the mall before it closes. Just then, two macaronis fell on the mall and onto the floor, and my dog named Tickle ate them. Daddy made a face. Hey, hey, hey! Slow down. What's the hurry? He said. We gotta get to the mall. That's what's the hurry. We gotta buy me a princess dress. Plus, I also need some shoes with lightning. Mother and Daddy looked funny at me. That's how come I had to explain all about handsome Warren. And how he loved Lucille's princess dress. And how he loved Grace's fast shoes. And so now I will get a princess dress. Plus, also, I will get shoes with lightning. And then Warren will love me, too. I wiped my mouth with my hand. Then I quick jump from my chair. Excuse me, please. Excuse me from the table, because I am all filled up. I run down the hall and zoomed into the nursery. The nursery is where my baby brother named Ollie lives. You guys do the dishes, I hollered to mother and dad. I'll put Ollie's sweater on his head because that'll save us time, I think. I quick climbed into Ollie's crib, then I tried to pull that baby sweater on him, only his giant head didn't fit through the hole. He waked up from his nap. Uh oh, this is not good, people. Oh, oh, not good. Not good. Then he's trying to <laughs> very loud. I heard loud feet right now. Judy B. Jones, what do you think you're doing? Yelled an angry voice. It was my mother. She run into the room and picked up baby Ellie. She patted his giant head. That's quite a melon he has there, I said very quiet. Baby Ollie just kept crying. Want me to get a leash? I asked Mother. Let's put him on a leash, okay? Because he's all jazzied up, I think. And so how will we even control him at the mall? Mother rolled her eyes way back in her head. We're not going to the mall, Junie V. Jones, she said. We're not going anywhere. I stamped my foot. Yes, I said. We have to. We have to. We have to go to the mall and get my princess dress and my shoes with lightning. Or else that boy will not love me, I tell you. <laughs> Mother closed her eyes. She did some deep breaths. Her voice got softer. Okay, I want you to listen to me. And I want you to listen carefully, she said. You don't make friends by wearing new dresses or shoes with lightning. You make new friends by being fun to be with and by being nice to people and by caring about their feelings. She lifted me out of the crib. And honesty is important too, Junie B. By caring about their feelings and honesty. You have to be honest with people and that means you can't pretend to be someone you're not. She smoothed my hair. You're not Lucille, Junie B, and you're not Grace either. You're just you. 
you're just Junie B. Jones. And believe me, that's enough job for anyone. Yeah, only I know I am Junie B. Jones, I said. I just want to be Junie B. Jones in a princess dress. I feel you, girl. I put my head on her shoulder. Didn't you ever want a princess dress when you were a little girl? I asked, huh? Mother, did you? Mother didn't answer. She was thinking it over, probably. Just that I looked over her shoulder. I saw a new toy on baby Ollie's shelf. Hey, what's that? Mother, what's that on the shelf there? Is that a new teddy bear I see? I run and pulled that guy down. Look, mother, look at this bear. Look at what this bear is wearing. It's a ribbon made out of rich red velvet. And that is exactly the kind of cloth I've been looking for. I took the bow off of Teddy and I held it next to my hair. How do I look, huh, mother? Do I look like a beautiful princess? Do I look gorgeous, huh? Do I? Just then, I felt happy and sparkly inside. I quick kissed mother and zoomed out of the room. Because maybe there was more princess clothes right in my very own house. Maybe. So, who were the characters? Junie B. Jones. Oh, hold on. Junie B. Mom. Dad. Ollie. Who else? Anybody else? Yes. Yep, Ollie. Okay. What was the setting? Where were they? Yes. Okay, so they were in the house. What two rooms? Uh, Ollie's room and yes. The dining room. At kitchen, wherever they eat. Okay, what was the problem? There were two problems. Yes. Sorry. She wants a princess dress. Okay. And the other one was she woke up her brother. Yeah, and she wants She wants new shoes with lightning, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. The solution. What was the solution about wanting a princess dress? Yes. She saw a red ribbon and realized there were more print there there not there were there might be right she doesn't know for sure might be more princess dresses in the house what about the other problem waking up brother was there a solution Yes. What's the solution for? Did mom come soothe brother? Yeah. Mom. Brother. Sorry, friends at home. I know you can't really read it. All right. I can't wait to see you for the next chapter. Bye, guys.